great stuff, JC. No, it was nothing. I want you to know you're my go-to guy now. I really trust yous. Aw, thanks, Vinny. And now I can finally get that private buyer off my case. <laughs> Time to arrange a meeting. I'll be in touch afterwards. All I need to do is follow you to Rex Fury. What could go wrong? I told you I'd trust you to find my dad, Chase. Don't you trust me? What? I, I'm kinda... Look, I know you've got cops keeping tabs on me. You do? I mean, what? I haven't arranged anything like that. I have somewhere I need to go, Natalia. Don't pretend, Chase. I'm at the hospital, and I can see them watching me from across the road. What do they look like? Uh, well, really smartly dressed for cops. They're wearing black suits, and they're standing by an unmarked black van and a limousine. They're not cops, are they? I don't think so. And now they're coming towards the hospital. Chase? Yes? Help! Natalia? Natalia? Really? This again?
Yikes. Things really went from bad to worse. This must be where the hospital stores all its huge fires.
I'm trying! You ain't kidding! There's no way to climb up there! But I could climb up there. Ellie, I think I'll need another favor soon. What is it this time? Does the department have a safe house anywhere? So people are after Natalia, so she can't go back to her own place. All the safe houses are booked up, I'm afraid. Chan's guys are in them, selling each other out. But, uh, if she doesn't mind couch surfing, she could stay at my place. Is it safe? I've got a big dog, although the only way he'll help is if the bad guys are allergic to him. Well, it's better than sharing with one of Chan's guys. Thanks again, Ellie. Not a problem. I'll head there now. Do you need backup? No time. I can handle this.
My legs better not get tired halfway up. Must not get to her. Well, okay. I hope this chicken can take both of our weights. Are you saying I weigh a lot? Yes. I'm choosing this exact moment to discuss how much you weigh. Where's the hospital's helicopter? One day it's not here. Of course. A helicopter. Oh, sure. The hospital's helicopter is always buzzing around the building when I'm carrying files that can blow out of my hands. But as soon as I'm getting pursued by mysterious men, nowhere to be seen. Keep back. I'll deal with them. Yeah, I think that's for the best. I hope that's all of them. Get in. Really? You can fly a helicopter? Let's find out. Who were those men? No idea. They didn't look like Chan or Vinny Papalardo's guys. They don't even look like Rex's thugs either. The only time you see them in suits is in court. Are they the people who took my dad, Chase? They could be. But I thought Rex was behind that. What does your dad do? He's a professor. He worked on Apollo Island for years, but he's been on a private research contract for the last few months. Oh? I don't know the details, and he kept his cabin locked up tight because of the precious stones he was working with. What's going on, Chase? I'm not 100% sure. Chan and Vinny were working for Rex. These other guys? Maybe Rex is working for them. I'll find out. But first, I'm taking you to a friend's place. She's called Ellie. You should be safe there. Thank you, Chase. Huh? Was that a nice thing you just said to me? Don't push it. Fine. I only saved your life. So it looks like I know how to fly a helicopter then. Now I know that you have to switch off their engines after you land. I suppose I owe you an apology. I know you've been trying to protect me. I was just worried about my dad. And I know you didn't mean to reveal my identity during Rex's trial. Oh, right. So why have you been such a pain? Well, I still wasn't happy about it. When I first met you, I trusted you completely. I... 
I might have even had some feelings. So when you just left like that? Feelings? <laughs> Shut up. So, would you like to see a movie sometime? <laughs> you're actually kind of sweet, Chase. But you're married to your job, and I don't date married men. How about coffee? Just find my dad, Chase. Tea? A tiny cookie? Ice cream? Ice cream. Vinny's meeting with Rex. Please don't have left the restaurant yet. Hey there, Chase. Vinny's been telling me how you're his number one guy now. Don't worry, I ain't jealous. Is he around? He, uh, said something about meeting some private buyer guy? Yeah. To tell you the truth, I'm a little worried. That guy he's meeting, he used to run all the rackets in this city before he got put away. Now he's out? I just hope he ain't trying to cut Vinny out of the equation. You want me to make sure Vinny's okay? Vinny would disown me if he knew I'd sent someone to look after him. Right. So he can't know. All I got was that they were meeting outside in Paradise Sands. Get up somewhere high, and with a bit of luck, you'll be able to see him. Right. Thanks, Mo. No, thank you. Sorry, police business. Howdy. Now! Just know I haven't got the job. How's things?
not spoil the pieces of it. Wow. So this is Frank's parents' hotel. They must be loaded. Right. I need to get onto the rooftop. Ugh, back in five minutes. I don't have five minutes. I guess I'll have to get up the hard way. If you ain't a gym member, you ain't coming in here. I am a gym member. Of course you are. I bet you don't even know how to use that fitness equipment. All right. I guess you must be a gym member, even though I don't recognize you and you haven't provided any ID.
Are you staying at my folks' hotel? No. I'm looking for Vinnie Papillardo and Rex Fury. Well, I can check the guest book. Th that isn't good. Never mind. Have you seen anything suspicious happening from up here? No. Apart from the sinister-looking helicopter that flew overhead a few minutes ago and then landed on the building opposite the Herbert Hotel? The Herbert Hotel? Then that's where I'm going. Hey, what's wrong with my parents' hotel? Is this about that guest who ate the chocolate on his pillow and it turned out it was a cockroach? See you, Chase! the guy who took my car and ruined our party! Oh, brother.
got more than a hundred studs for my old car. Huh? I'm getting really good at using those catapults. Yeah. 
Another catapult. Awesome. I need to get to the back of the roof so I can see where that helicopter landed. That's Rex. Vinny is working for him. I'll never get over there. What are they saying? Another job! We had a deal! I got chance to get you all in vehicles. I got you that T-Rex. I got you the Bell Pepper Emerald. And that boat! Do you know how much trouble I had someone else go through for that? Well, I've still got more stuff on my shopping list, Vinny. And you are gonna get it for me. I ain't even been paid for the other stuff yet! I have overheads, you know. And them paintings you gave me ain't any good. What do you mean? They're Bricassos! Really? They look more like faces. Ah, just get the stuff, Vinny, or I'll have to replace you. Rex Fury makes my blood boil! We do all the jobs, we take all the risks, but he treats us like monkeys and gives us, uh... Peanuts? Chase, what did you hear? Nothing, except you mentioned Rex Fury. Eh, what does it matter? Yeah, that's the private buyer I've been working for, and he's just pushed me too far! Nobody gets away with treating the papalados like this! We're gonna do a job just for us! We do all the jobs, we take all the risks, but he treats us like monkeys and gives us, uh... Peanuts? Chase, what did you hear? Nothing. Except you mentioned Rex Fury. Eh, yeah, what does it matter? Yeah, that's the private buyer I've been working for, and he's just pushed me too far. Nobody gets away with treating the papalados like this. We're gonna do a job just for us. What you got in mind? The biggest cheese in Lego City. The Von Stufenberg Cheddar Truckle? Not that kind of cheese. I mean Forrest Blackwell, property magnet, fridge magnet, and king of this city. Forrest Blackwell? I'll tell Mo to take the fire boat and meet you. Get moving. Okay, Vinny. I can't blow my cover yet. 
Not until I've arrested Rex. Chase. I figured this tunnel would look fancier, seeing as Blackwell's so rich. It ain't finished, is it? Blackwell lost interest in building stuff after the scandal. Oh, yeah. What was the deal with that? What? Have you been on holiday for the last few years? <sighs> Not quite. Blackwell was gonna build this massive apartment complex with a mall and everything up in Bluebell National Park. But then someone finds some sort of rare squirrel there, so City Hall stops him. By then, he'd already spent billions building Blackwell Bridge to connect the clock to uptown. That must have been embarrassing for him. Oh yeah. He didn't take it kindly. Vowed he'd never build anything again. Right. Now, we gotta be quiet. I'll wait here and keep the engine running. Get up there, get the stuff, and get back down. Okay. Really quiet around here. Maybe Blackwell security guys are on holiday. Thank you. 
Okay, Chase. Don't take anything too valuable. Just find something shiny that Vinny will like. If I was a secretive billionaire, where would I hide my vault? Oh, right. Chase, some guys came out of nowhere and are after me. I'm trying to lead them away from you. Hurry up! Okay, I'll grab the stuff and get out of here. Yeah, that won't attract more attention. See? Now that's a sensible place to hide a vault. One more layer protecting the vault. Uh oh, company. Sesame! Or just open, if you have a nut allergy. Whoa, that looks like a lot of money. No wonder Vinny's had his eye on this place. Who are you? Uh... Go, go, go! Don't let him escape! 